Hi guys, it's Nancy and welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. You know, there is a local Dollar Tree in my area and I just randomly stopped by there today and uh, ended up finding a few good things. Not a big haul, but some fun things, you know? And so I thought I'll just make a quick video and show you guys what I got. So right, you know, I'm in the middle of kind of getting ready for lunch and here we go. You want to see what I picked up? Okay, let's go. You know, by the way, before I get started, I want to tell you about this great lunch that I've been enjoying. It's from Trader Joe's, the root vegetable fries. Have you guys seen these? One point and you put them in the air fryer and you know, it's just like having a side of french fries with your lunch. And they have parsnips in them and parsnips are so delicious. They do taste like a potato. One point for a serving size. So it's, it's the root vegetable fries, roasted sweet potatoes, carrots, beets, and parsnips. One point. So I'm gonna have that and I'm gonna make me a fish burger. So I picked up these Mahi Mahi burgers. I'm sure you guys have seen these because they've been in the store forever. But the Mahi Mahi burgers, so good, two points. Uh, and I use mine, I do a skillet method, just a little bit of sp oil spray and make the burger, it's so good. You guys, it really does taste like a, you know, like a filet of fish. And I use it on a low carb hamburger bun, so I've been having that for lunch. So three points for the burger and one point for the fries. It feels like a filet of fish and fry you know, meal. So anyway, wanted to just share with you what I'm having for lunch. Okay, let's get into this again, really quick Dollar Tree haul. So I stopped by there actually for some paper plates because, um, you know, on Fridays I'm working from home and if I don't feel like dirtying up a bunch of plates, these are good to have for breakfast and lunch and they're only $1.25 at the Dollar Tree. So not only are things, you know, more expensive than a dollar, it's a whole quarter more over there at the Dollar Tree. But some things I still think you're pr finding a pretty good deal. You know, $1.25 for those plates, that's pretty good. Okay, I like to snack sometimes and I have been looking for this flavor of uh, David Ranch ranch sunflower seeds for the longest you know it's such a good little flavor profile now don't come for me i know the salt is ridiculous so you can't have them a whole lot i mean really i'm ashamed to even tell you that it's 207 percent of your daily intake <laughs> but i'll tell you what it's 207 percent of your daily intake of sodium for the entire package. Now, I'm not gonna eat this entire package. I'll probably have a handful at a time, right? And this entire package is eight points. So, you know, this it's probably eight servings or more in this bag. So one point a serving is how I do it. In fact, I have these new little snack bags that I have. Um, maybe I'll share those with you. And I've just been dividing out my snacks in these little baggies. In fact, hold on. Okay, so here they are. I got this little snack size baggie from Target, you know, and it's really, really small. And uh, it doesn't say, it just gives you this, the length and the width of the little baggie, but it's really small. And you could divvy up a lot of your uh, things, your snacks. So for example, I real I discovered these Snyder of Hanover Twisted Pretzel Sticks. I didn't get these from the Dollar Tree. But these are so good. Oh my gosh, guys. This is the seasoned buttery. It's delicious. And so I just measured them out. So in the bag, you know, I just go in here and I get a, a snack size. So four points a serving, but they are so yummy, you know. Uh, the other day I had some soup and had these as a little side, you know, like my bread component. But anyway, all that to say is, yeah, the sodium is crazy on these sunflower seeds. But if you, you know, just divvy up a few in your little snack packs, you're good to go. And one point for sometimes, you know, we are craving these kind of um, 
salty, savory snacks. Those sunflower seeds are pretty good. And you know, the they're not so awful in terms of health value, right? It's better than chips, if you ask me. And 12 grams of protein, of course, for the entire bag. But you know, pretty good. Okay, so that's one thing I picked up. Now, to combat all of that salt, <laughs> I picked up some sugar, but it's sugar-free. You know, these Jell-O snack packs, zero points. And uh, it's five calories a serving, $1.25 for four of them. So I went ahead and picked up two because, you know, you can't beat that price point. And zero points for a snack. And you know what I have? Some one point canned whipped cream. Just throw this on top and you have a delicious little dessert treat for the night for one point. And if you don't want the whipped cream, zero points. So this is the sugar-free, low calorie, juicy gels by Snack Pack. I have two strawberry and two orange here. And again, it's, you know, $1.25 for four of them. I think that's a pretty good deal. Zero points a snack. You know, that's incredible. And so I'm going to put those in the fridge, get them nice and cold, because, of course, today is September 1st. We're still in September, but, you know, uh, we're still in summer, I should say, even though it's September 1st. Um, but it's warm, you know, so adding those to the fridge and get them nice and cold, it's a good little treat. Okay, I also picked up from the Dollar Tree some classic Alfredo sauce from Prego. So two points per serving for this uh, Alfredo Prego sauce. I love that the dollar store has, you know, brand name uh, items sometimes. Uh, again, did I tell you two points a serving? Now there's seven servings in this little bitty can. So you gotta be careful how much you use. But you know, I've been doing my crock pot meals lately, you know, and so I have also some carbonata noodles and those noodles are only, I think, two points a serving. Hold on, I'll show you. Yeah, I think, I think it's two points a serving. I could be wrong. If I'm wrong, I'll add it down at the bottom. But, you know, I'm thinking of this carbon noodle, uh, these uh, carbonata noodles that I picked up on Amazon, and the Prego, and probably some Tyson blackened chicken for, uh, you know, a low point crock pot meal. So I'm looking forward to that. And again, I'm glad that the Dollar Tree will sometimes have like brand name items. So $1.25 for this Alfredo sauce. I'm interested in trying it. Okay, so, you know, I've been on my protein kick and I love freaking tuna. You know, I love these uh, flavored tunas. And I shared this with you on my protein finds uh, video not too long ago. But, you know, sometimes you go in the store and they're as, as high as $2.50. So $1.25 for my Starkiss tuna. This is the ranch and this is the bumblebee sriracha. I'll take it. You know, that's a really good price. And I love this sriracha one because I kind of love the spice. But, you know, these are such a good little protein find, a point or two for the pouches of tuna and you can get a couple servings, you know, out of them. I rarely eat a, an, an entire packet, you know, unless I'm uh, really hungry, but most times I'll add a little light mayo and I could spread it over a couple of meals, right? So then it really, the points are even lower, uh, but the protein value is so high. So um, tuna finds, name brand tuna finds at the Dollar Tree. You know, you can't pass that up. Okay, what else did I pick up? Um, I am uh, out of my fat-free half and half, which I use for my coffee, or a point, usually a point's worth, and I love the fat-free half and half because it's so creamy. But I'm out of it and thought I would treat myself a little bit to this hazelnut non-dairy creamer, $1.25, have it a couple of days this weekend. Why not? A point uh, is what this is coming up to on the WW Tracker. And... Um, you know, I'm sure that's probably something like a teaspoon. <laughs> it just says three grams, so a tiny bit. So for one point, you gotta be careful, but it's nice for a little treat every now and again. So hazelnut sweetened creamer. Okay, I also picked up some ketchup. 
So again, a name brand product over at the uh, Dollar Tree. We were out of it. And unfortunately, I didn't see the uh, sugar-free or low sugar. But Hunt's is a pretty good brand. And I don't use a lot of it. So like today when I have my french fries, I'll probably add a little bit of this to it. So, okay. And then I picked up another household item in addition to my paper plates. And these are um, the knockoff um quick eraser pads so you know i have white kitchen cabinets right and they can get dirty fast you know just going in and out of those cabinets uh, these things are literally magic you know <laughs> i mean they make your work so easy and it's such a light pressure uh pressure to add to the little pads and it gets you know um stains or marks that you didn't think you'd ever be able to get out um, out. So I love these things and I picked them up today for a dollar twenty. So the the name brand ones they last, you know, a little while, but this is, you know, this probably is good for a time or two because it's it's just uh, a no name brand. But I love these dry erasers. I'm sure you've seen them a million times. And that's it. That's my little quick Dollar Tree haul. Some you know fun little things. Fifteen dollars for this whole haul. So you know in this economy you know, it's good to shop at places like the Dollar Tree for everyday household items like my paper plates, you know? All right, that's gonna do it for me on this video, just quick and simple. I'm gonna go ahead and eat my lunch now, but uh, wanted to pop in and say hello and share that with you, and guess what? I'll see you on the next video, okay? Take care, guys. Bye! Don't forget to give me that like and subscribe. Okay, bye!